So in this video we explain uh, a little bit about the uh, troubleshooting the clean fog rod alarm and the easiest way to troubleshoot is just to understand how it actually works. It's triggered by this switch being in the on position and by the level changing too quickly. And the level can change too quickly because you put the rod back into the well so that's kind of what you're supposed to do to get the whole system running and that is going to trigger the alarm. So the first thing that happens is you have this switch in the on position you put the rod back into the well and when you do you see this start to flash and in the case of production units it takes three minutes before it latches so you're sitting there looking at some level and this thing flashing and you don't know why after three minutes with the production unit the relays will come on you'll start your pump this fault goes solid which means it's latched and these level LEDs are flashing and you think hey why is this doing this? It's just because you put the rod back in the well and that's a very fast level change and the LIT says there's uh, some concern there. Once you get used to it, it's very simple. Just clear it and you make it go away. Of course, the first time it happens, you think, um, I've just cleaned the rod, I've put it back into the well and now it's telling me to clean it again. So uh, obviously a little bit of training for people just to understand that. That's the, uh, the biggest reason for uh, this fault being confusing for people. Second reason is let's say we've um, it's in the on position middle of the night a rag comes in attaches itself to the fog rod and the level rises up on the rod and when it does it happens to make a bunch of contacts turn on together and um, that will turn on the fault relay that's good notice we haven't turned on all the level relays until such time as the timer runs out, which is three minutes in the uh, normal unit. So 20 seconds in this demo case. After three minutes, we turn on our pump. That's assuming that's our lead start point. And um, we've latched this fault on. Now the level empties in the well. The fault's still latched on. And let's say now, as the well starts to fill up, the to, we're in a turbulent part of the well, let's hope, and uh, the inflow is kind of relatively high, and uh, this rag gets knocked off. Great. So now the level will proceed upwards very, very slowly. Obviously, uh, I'm not going to simulate hours of level changes to show you, but everything will work as per normal. The rags disappeared off the, uh, off the rod. And now it's uh, the next day you come to site, you see this alarm, it says clean fog rod. You look down in the wet well, you see the rod looks pretty clean. You say, hey, why is the uh, fault here? It, it's just telling you that it happened and it could have been because there was a rag there. If the rod is clean, there's nothing to worry about. All you have to do is just clear the fault, put it back into the on position. That's important. Don't turn it off because you don't understand it. Put it back into the on position. And now everything will work as normal. And uh, if for some reason this fault keeps triggering and uh, you want to understand why, please give us a call. Thanks very much for watching.